Hello friends, once I have my image found, I need to convert my image to a raster file or a vector file using Inkscape. So Inkscape is this black diamond looking one here. We're going to click on that. Inkscape takes a couple seconds to load. Once it loads up, I'm just going to maximize my screen here. Now when I want to open a file that I've already saved, I go File open I then need to go find that file in the media drive so this PC media Dakinavich I'm looking in the test folder because that's where I've saved this and here I found Mr. D Vanier logo that we just saved I'm going to open that a little box is going to show up and give me some options I'm going to hit OK and now it will open up and give me my logo. So this logo may or may not trace nicely, but if we look, we can see that we have a blue dotted line around, but it doesn't touch my image. So when I want to trace my image, I simply select my image, get that blue dotted line to show up, right click, trace bitmap. It's going to give me another pop-up box with some options where it says brightness cutoff, I want to change brightness cutoff to auto trace and then I want to hit OK. I can now close this dialog box and I now have two images laid on top of each other. If I pull this one away we can see that this image the lines are very tight, this image they're not, so this becomes our original image. We want to delete our original image simply by hitting delete it disappears. We then have our new image and we're going to save this image. So we go File, Save As. We've already named it Mr. D. Vanier Logo. The thing that we want to change here is we want to take it from an Inkscape SVG file and we want to turn it into the Desktop Cutting Plotter AutoCAD DXF. The top one here which is R12. We're going to select that and then we're going to hit Save. Now we'll have a file that AutoCAD can read.